The design concept was to use custom furniture in order to create an open space. For this, we teamed up with a product designer that helped us to conceive a set of slide and fold furniture pieces that can be used for multiple purposes, but can be hidden away when not in use. If you're a fan of this Never Too Small episode, our new book is perfect for you. Discover our top 30 small footprint homes, available for pre-sale at the Never Too Small store. We sought references of projects from Asia, where there is a dense population. Asia has a long history of designing small spaces, and we researched their methods and solutions. The apartment is located in Consolação, São Paulo, Brazil. Consolação is a vibrant and traditionally bustling neighborhood in central São Paulo. It is famous for its rich cultural life with easy access to subway stations and bus lines. The client's brief was to transform the existing 29 square meters into a multifunctional space, which would fit his lifestyle. The apartment was a blank canvas. Originally, there was a kitchenette by the entrance, a living room, a separate bedroom with an ensuite bathroom, and a terrace. We demolished the walls that separated the bedroom and living room and moved the kitchen to the other side to create one unified living, kitchen, dining and sleeping space. The flexible use of the space was achieved by creating hybrid furniture, which not only provided multifunctionality but also gave the apartment a more open feeling. At the entrance, there is a bench with a coat hanger above and a shoe rack below. Besides the bench is a utility cupboard with a built-in space for a small washing machine. Even though the building has a communal laundry room, it is quite small and always in use, so our client requested to have one within the apartment itself. On the opposite side, there is a closet with drawers space for hangers and shelves at the top. This is the main storage space in the apartment for clothes and bedding. The kitchen is along the wall at the end of the hallway. The kitchen was an important space for the client who loves to cook. For this purpose, we created a 3 meter black granite countertop with a small splashback. We added the same green tiles that were used on the floor above. The countertop is equipped with a large sink, a cooktop, a stove and a microwave. Above the sink, there is an integrated drying rack. The dining table is a folding table that can be freely moved around the apartment. The chairs also fold and can be stored within the table. With the intention of each space having its own personality, we designed the floor of the apartment with different finishing materials. Hardwood for the intimate area, hydraulic cement tiles for the kitchen area and balcony. For the living area, we worked in collaboration with product designer Laura Garcia to create a collection of uniquely crafted hybrid furniture. The first is a sofa, which is integrated to the storage wall behind. It is finished in natural frejo wood and has custom red cushions. We designed matching coffee table with casters so they can be easily moved around. By adding a cushion, they can also be used as a footrest for the sofa. The storage wall behind the sofa spans the entire length and height of this room. It contains an area on each side for plants and personal objects. In the evening, the section behind the sofa falls down using a hydraulic system to reveal a large bed. 
The main custom piece we created for the living area is hidden within the mirror wall. It slides out to reveal a wood and light green laminate room divider. On one side there is a TV integrated right into the unit, with a sound wire hidden below. All the electronics are neatly hidden away for a seamless look. On the other side, there is a fold-out table that can be used as a kitchen surface when prepping meals or as another great option when working from home. When the desk or TV is not in use, the whole unit simply slides back into the mirror wall and disappears out of sight. We chose a flexible lighting system for the apartment to use depending on the client's activities. For the kitchen and dining area, we chose lights that can be directed in different positions. The main source of natural light for the entire apartment is through the large glass door that opens up to the terrace. It has amazing panoramic views of the city. On the terrace, we added a vertical garden and a plant stand for herbs and spices. With all the doors open, the terrace is an extension of the apartment. There is a hidden entrance to the bathroom behind the mirror wall. We kept the bathroom layout the same as before, but gave it new life using the yellow epoxy paint in the shower. Above the sink is a large mirror cabinet with some open shelves and some storage behind the doors. The sink is in the same granite material as the kitchen countertop. In Brazil, it's common for new buildings to be built with only the walls, floor and some basic plumbing. This allows the new owner to customize it to their needs and taste. Designing a small space revolves around the belief that limitations are not constraints, but rather opportunities for creativity and innovation. Thanks for watching. And if you're an architect or designer with a project we could feature, please share it with us at nevertoosmall.com slash submissions.